Hello and welcome to Point of View. And here comes China's 24th orbital launch of the year. Yet another historic launch that created a new record for putting maximum number of satellites in orbit atop one rocket, breaking a previous record that was made barely a week ago. A Long March 2D Y88 carrier rocket blasted off 1.30 p.m. on Thursday, June 15 afternoon from a service tower surrounded by mountains at the Taiyuan Satellite Launch Center in Shaanxi Province, thundering up into sunny skies. It successfully transported 41 Jilin, one satellite setting a new domestic of number of satellites in a single launch. Of course, SpaceX once launched 143 satellites with a single rocket, so the competition is stiff. These Jilin-1 satellites will be used for commercial remote sensing services and verification of related technologies. The satellite constellation also included the Jilin-1 Gaofen 06A satellite. This was the 476th flight mission of the Long March rocket series. Designed and manufactured by the Shanghai Academy of Spaceflight Technology, a CASC subsidiary, the Long March 2D is one of the most reliable rockets in this nation. Since its debut in August 1992, the model has been used in 76 flights, all of which have been successful. Onboard satellites included 36 from the Jilin-1 family, developed by the Changwang Satellite Technology Company, Limited, a commercial satellite maker in northeast China's Jilin province. They will increase the number of in-orbit Jilin-1 satellites to 108, assembling China's first commercial constellation of more than 100 remote sensing satellites. The first Jilin-1 group was launched in October 2015. Over the past eight years, the weight of each satellite with the same function has been greatly reduced from 420 kilograms to 22 kilograms. He Xiaojun, chief designer of the Jilin-1 Gaofen 06A, said the weight reduction has benefited from the use of upgraded image sensors, improved design techniques and advanced integrated chips. The changes do not affect the resolution of satellite images but expand their visible range by 50%. They also lower the cost to 1 20th of previous satellites, he said. Just like the evolution of computers, the scientist explained, from bulky desktops to today's laptops and smartphones, the devices have been reduced in size due to technology upgrades. But the computing performance is improving. According to the company, the newly launched satellites will be used to provide commercial remote sensing data services for sectors such as land resources, mineral exploration, and smart city construction. That's a wrap. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.